Once children have got the hang of using arrays, <coughs> they can then start using arrays uh, with sums that will give them a remainder. Um, so I'm just going to do this example. So let's do 17 divided by 3. So the children should know that they need three little people or three groups. And that they're sharing 17 out between them. Now it's important to keep them one dot to one square because then it'll be easy to see these two here, this one's missing. So when we say how many have they got each, well, everybody has got one, two, three, four, five. But there are two left over, because this one doesn't get one. So our answer is 5 with the remainder of 2.